Hi everyone, it's Janice here. I just wanted to come on right quick and share with y'all the um, uh, paper pads that I got from a Hobby Lobby. You know, they had them for 50% off last week. I had seen a, a, a few videos um, uh, where um, they had gotten some, some new ones in. So I went by Saturday and um, they did have a few new ones, but I believe that my Hobby Lobby was very picked over. Um, the only new Prima one that my Hobby Lobby had was the uh, Lifetime in the 6x6, and I already have that, so I didn't purchase it. I got the Authentic uh, Seasons Essentials. And this is a uh, 2013, and uh, it's something for all seasons. And um, I'm not going to really go through these, but um, it's just, you know, got some in there for like winter and fall and, and summer, spring. I thought that they would be really pretty for for uh, card making, isn't that a pretty one? That's a winter. Let's see. That's the uh, fall. Isn't that pretty? It's a, a barrel, wooden barrel of apples with a dolly behind it and then up in the other corner. I thought that was really pretty. It says harvest time. like a uh, honeycomb sheet. Let's see. This is one of the uh, summer ones. It's got the honeycomb with the bee. Isn't that pretty? And bicycles for summer. Let me show you a spring one. The spring one are the umbrellas. Let's see. There we go. The umbrella with the banners. How cute. Okay, it says says showers bring flowers right here hmm. okay and then I got farmhouse now this one says that it is a uh, 2012 but this is new to my Hobby Lobby and I thought that this would be really great uh, papers for a um, for like a recipe book or or a, a file, you know, file recipe file. It's really cute. It'd be cute. That's a, a banner page. It'd be cute in my kitchen. I have a lot of red and yellow in my kitchen. All right, and then I got the uh, six by six. Sugar Chic by Hottie Swap. Um, I do have this in the 12 by 12, but the uh, six by the 12 by 12 has a lot of uh, glitter sheets in it, but the uh, six by six has no glitter in it. I did get the uh, you know six by six because the the prints are smaller and you can uh, you know it's better for making cards. Now. This is a Prima Madeline, but this is not new. This is like a 2011, I think. Um, I had never picked this one up, so I thought that I had better go ahead and and uh, pick it up, you know, before they're all gone. It's really pretty papers. I know everyone has seen the Madeline. <laughs> okay, and then I got one 12 by 12. And this says it's a 2012 uh, paper pad, but 
you know, it, it, it's new to my Hobby Lobby. It's by Crate Paper, and it's called the DIY Shop. There's some really, really nice papers in here, y'all. Very pretty. Very, very, very pretty papers. Look at the typewriters. It's just a whole sheet of typewriters. Uh, wood planks. Love that. I love that shape. Those would be pretty to cut out. Blocking the light there. I don't really care for that one, but you know, there's always going to be one or two that you don't like. <laughs> uh, that's like a uh, pattern, sewing pattern. Really neat. Okay, that's all the Piper pads I got. And while I was at Hobby Lobby, I did go ahead and pick up a couple of other things. I just picked up a couple of packs of the Prima Flowers. I used a coupon for one, and Jeff used a coupon for one. I got one to go with the Madeline, and then one to go with my Botanical. And I picked up this burlap envelope. Isn't that cute? That would be so cute to uh, alter and put some goodies in for someone. That's my plan, and I might try to make some. I'm, I, you know, I've got some burlap. I may try to uh, make some. This is three ninety nine. I just, you know, I paid full price for it, but you know, I liked it, so I got it. <laughs> and then I just got some of the uh, paper sacks to make some cards with. They have the large one and the small one. I got the large. Yeah, they're not big though. They're let's see what size are these? Four and a half. Well, yeah, four and a half by eight. Point eighty eight, and then the gusset I guess is is uh, three inches. When you open it up, that's my Hobby Lobby. Then we went by Michaels, and um, I wanted to run through there and see what they had, and plus you know I wanted to use my coupon. Since I was down that way, they I did notice they had some new uh, bead landing uh, charms in, and these are metal pieces in their bows. Some of them have the little loopity on the top of it, so you can hang them as charms. I thought these were really neat. They're uh, fan blades or propellers. Really, really cute. And look, they had the spoons and forks. Love those. And then I don't think these little clocks are new, but they're really cute. So I went ahead and picked up those. They had those at 40% off. So, And then I used my coupon on some uh, feet for a box. Some Tim Holtz feet. They didn't have any of these Tim Holtz feet at Hobby Lobby. So that kind of concerns me. Okay, and then I got, they had their, uh, the green, uh, whatever, the green label, uh, beads on for, uh, 40% off that last week, so I picked these up, aren't they cute? Be cute as charms, on charms. And then I got these, these were on clearance for a couple bucks, so, little pearls with the, uh, silver back in Donald. So that is my weekend haul. Y'all leave a comment if you'd like and thanks for watching. Bye bye.